influencer our series of conversations with the world's digital thought leaders, the people creating the trends that we're all talking about. Our influencer this week made us all laugh for years as Phoebe on the sitcom Friends. Emmy winner Lisa Kudrow continues to enjoy success on both TV and in film, but what has especially intrigued us to her is her work in the digital space. Back in 2008, Lisa created and launched web therapy on lstudio.com. She may seem like she cares. What seems to be the problem? But she's no friend. Nothing you've said has ever even been slightly interesting. Lisa Kudrow is Fiona Wallace in Web Therapy. <laughs> so Web Therapy started very much as a, an online experiment, you yeah. said. Why, why do you say it's an experiment? Well, because we weren't sure that just two people talking on a computer mm -hmm. would be compelling enough for anyone to watch. Yeah. And, and then it turned out, yeah, it is. And it's improvised, so you can kind of sense that spontaneity, mm -hmm. I think, when you're watching it. And then we got great improvisers, too. But we just weren't sure. And then we just started, you know, risking having the webisodes get longer and longer. Yeah. And that worked out. And, um, and we also couldn't help it, but there was a narrative. Like, they weren't just individual webisodes. They're all sort well, of That helps because linked. then people need to go back, and you get those views. They want to go back. Right. I don't know if they did or not. <laughs> yeah. I'm not sure they did. So now it's going to be on Showtime, and that was the next challenge. It's like, so will this work in a half-hour format? And it does. That was just a That's great really surprise. That's really cool. Yeah. And, and hard because you're never sure about that. So we actually have... A Twitter question from Ember Moots who asks, which experience has been more rewarding, the comeback, web therapy on the web, or web therapy on TV? And is the goal still always TV? Well, let's see. I mean, mm, first of all, the, com the comeback. Yeah. Because, um, you know, I created that show, and that was just really fun to yeah. do and to act in. And web therapy, we're still doing it. So I don't know. I'm loving every second of it. It's just... It's really fulfilling, you know, to create that too. Well, where, where did the character and the storyline even stem from? Well, I mean, first we had the idea. Mm -hmm. First was the idea that, you know, there's this therapist who offers online yeah. therapy for three minute sessions. Mm -hmm. And because it's just the worst idea in the world. Mm -hmm. and, um, and then you have to think about what kind of person would do that. What kind of person thinks that it's a service? Well, this day and age, idea? you never know. Right, that's right. <laughs> Because of the internet. I wouldn't be surprised <laughs> if you gave some real therapists some ideas of a, you know, a c career change. How they should oh. actually do that for their work. <laughs> They're not allowed. <laughs> They're like, all right, not so allowed. what surprises you the most between your audiences online versus on TV? Well, I don't know. We haven't been on TV yet. Yeah. That's going to be July 19th. So we'll see. Yeah. You know, I mean, we'll see. But I, you know, really was expecting the older internet audience. Hmm, yeah. So that was the other why it was called an experiment because it was mostly you know people under thirty online when we started, uh, but more and more you know older people catch up, and yeah, catch I, on. So then they started actually you know coming to the internet and the numbers kept growing. That's so interesting. Well, you yeah. were there really much from the kind of an early adopter. Right. I think two thousand eight was when we. Yeah, the fall of 2008 was when we premiered on El Studio. Do people still say, oh, it's a web thing? Yeah, they do. Well, I mean, it, I, you know, but it is. I mean, it's a, it's a web series, and a lot of the content is, was on El Studio. Mm -hmm. That'll be on Showtime. Yeah. But I, th I don't know what's the difference. I mean, everyone's going to have a TV that's hooked up to the Internet. It's mm -hmm. going to be the same monitor. In like five minutes, we're not going to care yeah. where the content comes from. And so we actually have another Twitter user who asks Dave Peck, what did it take to move from web to full series? Well, it took, um, I mean, creatively, it took going back and looking at, you know, our Bible, what we've already established, yeah. and then seeing, um, you know, what do we want to explore more, what do we want to explain, and where else do we want to go? Yeah. To fill out a half hour. I know. Was that, I mean, did that present itself as a challenge? It was, but it was a fun challenge. And we did it. I mean, I'm really proud. And improvisation was so much part of the web. Was it the same for the TV show? Yes, because we did it the exact same way. Everything on Showtime has been on some kind of new media platform. Mm. So they're all webisodes, but they are connected and serialized. Interesting. Yeah, we'll see. It's very, really interesting. No, I think um, it's, But it's yeah. really funny. I mean, it is very funny. 
And, and I just love how you say it's all about content. It's like you, you've said, it doesn't matter where it's living, it's about content. The content's good, that's what matters. I think, I mean, I think that's always been, no matter whether it's a reality show or a scripted show, it's about compelling stories and characters mm -hmm. that you want to see. So, I'm, um, you know, I think ho hopefully, you know, that's what we've accomplished. I think and that's also, all. the celeb cameos you have from the web and now I'm sure the TV show. Um, how, you know, how did you get people involved in that way? Well, the great thing was, I think from the comeback, you know, I got uh, some credit from mm -hmm. actors. And so when I said, oh, we're doing well, this thing. Friends wasn't enough? Um, <laughs> but yeah, no, maybe that too. <laughs> but um, so when I'd say, I, you know, we're gonna do this web thing and here, and it's a th bad therapist, like, yes, I wanna do it, great. So we got these fancy, you know, Jane Lynch, yeah. first thing, and Bob Balaban in the first season, mm -hmm. and I mean, you know, Bob Balaban, he has an Oscar. But, um, <laughs> you know, we had, we had fantastic people in that first season, yeah. and so then it's like, well, if they did it, I can do it, hopefully. Or, you know, they just started hearing about it. Don and Dan, you know, have a lot of friends. Dan Bukatinsky and Don Roos, yeah, my co-creators. Yes. Yeah, You're and Don Roos, who's, yeah. you know, a major writer-director of film. Is, you know, I mean, we had the best of the best. Yeah, and, and so what's the process? when Are they actually sitting in front of a a laptop? Do you put them no. in that position? No, that would be really uh, ugly. <laughs> no, we're, um, no, no, we have cameras and the cameras have prompters right underneath the lens and it's a monitor. So we're looking at each other in real time and we have these earwigs. Okay. Earwig or earwig? They're IFB things. IFB. The I, what we, we have what in our ear right now. The IFB. IFB. Yeah. That's what I'm going to call it from now on. <laughs> IFB. It'll sound really Because I don't know what I'm saying with the other one. But, and we can hear each other in real time and Don can talk to us too in in our ear. It's that it's that technical. Yeah. <laughs> it is, but it's the only way to do it and look okay and then we can cut cuz there's two cameras so we can have, you know, you just put the two people together or singles. Is it important for you to I guess own what you do in your audience because it seems like you have your production company, you're executive producing a lot of this. Is that important to you? Only in that, you know, if I have an idea for something, yeah. I don't think anyone's going to want to do it but me. So well, really? I'm going to have to, <laughs> we will have to do it ourselves. Well, you're making it happen. Yeah, that's what's fun. That's what's exciting. Awesome. And of course, all of you, catch up on Web Therapy, the web series online at lstudio.com. And of course, now on TV. So exciting. Yay, thank the you. The premiere of Web Therapy, July 19th at 11 p.m. on Showtime. Thanks so much, Lisa, for being here. I appreciate thank it. Thank you. Thank you. This is fun.